Today is day one of what Anjali? Day one of me moving to an Airbnb for the next one week. You might think, oh no, my address is visible here. Do not look at my address. Put something over it. I am not going for vacation. I am actually going six days to an Airbnb that's like 10 minutes away from my house to film my first cooking course. And this is all the camera equipment that I have rented. Wow, look at all this equipment. Oh, tripods and what is this, a lens? Camera, oh my God. You know, I could like geek out over cameras and forget about moving to the Airbnb. I have it. Oh, look at that, wow. Okay, I'm gonna keep figuring this out, but I will let you do. <laughs> arrived at the, the Airbnb. It is so much larger than my own apartment, obviously. But I thought I'd show you around. I don't have my mic, so the audio is gonna be super awful. I have this whole apartment to myself, and it's funny because it's like two bedrooms and stuff. There's one bedroom. A second bedroom, which I think is cute, and this is where I'm gonna sleep. It's so cute, look at this. Bathroom, place for morning business. And the most fun part about this place is this huge balcony that's gonna go wasted completely. Look at that. Wow, it's a huge balcony. Everything's gonna go to waste because this place is not for vacation. Yay! <sighs> I'm so tired. <laughs> and I'm sure my arms are gonna be so sore tomorrow from lunging around and all of that, but I still have two more rounds to go for my clothes and then pr fresh produce and, and then I need to go to buy more things because I need more fresh vegetables and frozen vegetables. <sighs> Round two, three. Still day one. So I took a shower and now I'm gonna, oh, I'm gonna show you something cool. How cool is that? Like, I want to buy this house. Yeah. I want a kitchen like this. Anyway, and that's why I booked this Airbnb because I don't have a sexy kitchen like this. So I'm going to I'm going to start preparing for tomorrow because I want to do that thing where you know when I'm filming, I don't want I don't I don't want to be like chopping everything and doing everything at the same time. So that magical thing when people in cooking videos do like, "Oh, uh, you know, these have already been soaking and oh by the way I also have like some pre-prepared vegetables right here and just I'm just gonna add some chopped vegetables chop something else I'm too tired but you get what I'm saying right I, by the way I brought Alexa with me because she's my only friend when I'm home and I couldn't leave Alexa alone there I had to bring Alexa with me she would have been too lonely I'm gonna start preparing and you can watch me prepare for tomorrow good morning according to Alexa right now it's 6.42 a.m. I've been up for a while I woke up at 6 because my natural waking up time is 6 and I woke up even though I slept really late last night well late by my standards because for me I usually wake sleep at around like 10 yes last night I slept at 12 um, so I'm gonna start uh, start setting up the cameras uh, I want to start filming by at least like 9, 9 in the morning or 9.30. Yeah, 9. That's like a typical work, work time. I'm going corporate. <laughs> <laughs> So I'm in the middle of the shoot and I'm waiting for something to cook. It's day one by the way. Did I say that? 
Oh my god, the only problem, I mean, it's really fun. I mean, I'm excited about the course and everything. The only problem is like I'm managing everything by myself. So, two cameras, one light, uh, and I'm also trying to like vlog at the same time. Next time, hopefully, whenever I do get to film, like to create another course, I will have a team to myself. And it's not just like me running around doing this, this whole thing. Okay, I have to get back to my course. Courses won't be made with while I'm vlogging, so see you. I think I'm halfway done with the recipes I had planned for today, but I think I will have to stop here. I don't, or, or maybe I will like restart after dinner or something like that. But at this moment, I'm, I'm so dead. Plus I'm on my period, you know? It just makes things worse, like a hell a lot worse. But luckily I was smart about this. I am smart. I actually kept the, f the final few days in this Airbnb partially, but I wouldn't say empty, but like kinda like I kept them freer than the initial two, two days. So at least there's that. So if, even if I am not able to complete all the recipes today, I know that I have like a few days at the end to do it. And that's it. So that that was day one. So it's officially day two. I just had like some coffee and I've been slicing vegetables. These are all the vegetables I sliced. Well, that's rice. And I feel ready for the day. We are ready to do this. It's gonna be better than yesterday because now I don't need to do the setup. Yesterday I lost a lot of time when I was trying to set up all the camera and everything. See, maybe maybe I can like catch up on all the recipes like from yesterday and today. <gasps> you think I'm capable of it? You think I'm capable of it? I am going at such a slow rate. I think I might have to rebook this apartment because I mean, slow rate in the sense like slower than I expected. I was expecting like to go pop, 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 recipe after recipe, but that's not happening. Like if I want to do this well, this has to be done well. I have a lot of food as well piling up now and I have called in like a couple friends to come and pick up the food. I'm gonna get changed, wait for my friends to come and pick up the food, shower, eat something and go to bed. No, no, I still have to prepare so much for tomorrow. Oh my God. <laughs> this is amazing. I, I didn't expect this whole uh, 10 days to be about complaining, although it's me, so it had to be complaining. <sighs> okay. I'm having breakfast. I'm having dosha and samba with some with some coffee. Mm. This is day three, by the way. And I'm having uh, breakfast in the beautiful balcony that, that I thought that, you know, I should make use of it since I have it. It is so good. Mm. I'm teaching everything in the course. So, if you want to learn how to make proper dosha and samba, join the course. <laughs> I'll finish my breakfast now. It's 5 p.m. day three. I think I will go crazy by the end of this week from cooking so much. I know nothing about the outside world. I just know me, my cameras and my food. I might even take a break from Indian food. Actually, no, I still love what I'm making. I was thinking I might take a break, like I would be so tired of it, all the food that I'm making, but actually no. One of the things I realized when I was filming and cooking everything is just that no matter how much I make Indian food, it just never stops blowing my mind at how incredibly amazing and delicious it is and that you just cannot get tired and each bite makes me so happy i'm really happy that i'm making this course for people because i want people to also learn and share this this joy with me because when you make indian food it just it's so delicious it's it's so good it goes on to prove you don't need meat to have good food I had my friends over yesterday and they ate some food and there was it and uh, like they were like so so happy and excited they're meat eaters but for them this food was just good like good enough they didn't miss meat and they were like wow this is so good and everything it's like Indian food really helps people not miss meat and I want to share this with people I want to share this with the world and that's one of the reasons why I'm creating this course as well oh my god okay, I have things to do bye I'm so spent. Today was a lot of troubleshooting. 
um i started filming a certain rep, ep, a certain episode and i realized that i didn't have the necessary ingredients and tomorrow i will have to go shopping so that will take out some time from my filming in any case whatever i could manage was uh, not bad all the food turned out really good i'm excited about sharing the recipes in the course and i am barely able to open my eyes right now. i have chopped so many onions because of this course <laughs> it's really funny and then i also like cut myself and grate myself here and there sometimes like i'm trying to be as careful as possible uh because i want to be a good example but sometimes i, I i'm a bad example you know in those things i just finished filming a few recipes and one of them is this kulfi i'm okay, not gonna lie i am quite enjoying this part like the eating part oh, i get to eat like so much good food mm. i'm dying just filming all day every day it's, my back hurts like hell oh, i'm standing like all day long i still want to film one more recipe today what day is this it's day four and it's day four Oof, 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 oof. This was a really difficult project that I took up. In case day five, I was thinking that I'm supposed to make a few breakfast recipes, and I, I thought maybe I would film it and eat that for breakfast. So that way, like, I'm mentally, I have like, I think that oh yeah, one recipe is already done before breakfast. I feel super productive. Like I just finished uh, filming what I want to eat for breakfast, and. And it's it's 9 a.m. This is usually the time when I start to film, or like a bit after that. This is when I start to like film. But today, I'm already done with one recipe. I feel good. I feel good. This day is gonna go well. It's almost 12, and um, I sent out my newsletter quite late today um, because it's my thing. I have to send out my newsletter. Which, by the way, if you want subscribed. You can subscribe to it with a link that I will show somewhere around my head. Or it will be, uh, the link would be in my description because that's the space where I really connect with my audience. I think one of them designed a wallpaper and sent it to me and I'm going to show it to you. It's so cute and it's, it's so sweet and uh, it really cheered me up and it, I immediately made it my wallpaper. Like I kind of need it because when I'm working and if I'm like I start jump into YouTube or something like that, this would be like a good reminder when I'm switching between windows. Like, Get back to work. I'm like okay, ma'am. Yes, I will. Anyway, the wallpaper was designed by uh, Mrinmal. Thank you, Mrinmal, for this cute gift. It's my wallpaper now. Tomorrow is my last day for filming, and the day after that is my last day at the Airbnb. I have to leave my Airbnb on that day and I have to return. The cameras and the tripod because the tra cameras and the tripod that I was using for this course were rented. Yeah, I will have to say goodbye to these beautiful cameras. I wish I owned them, but they're so expensive. I can't afford them myself. Maybe with the course, I would be finally able to buy like a nice camera. It's just bad speculations. I don't even know if anyone's gonna buy my course. But really, I put my heart and soul into this. I really. It would it would make my day if even like one person buys it, which would not pay back for all the costs that I incurred in making the course, but still would be worth it even if one person buys it really. Anyway, I'm gonna try and go to sleep and try to be fresh enough for tomorrow's last day of filming. I'm kinda miss this. I, I, yeah, I had fun. Yeah. Hi, good morning. It is, I just woke up. It is um day six. Then I have to prepare my hair and everything. Like, it looks like this. Not acceptable for the course, for the YouTube videos and my reels and everything is fine, but the course is kind of professional. I have to empty the, the dishwasher and then start preparing for the first video. So lots of things, but first I'm going to get some coffee so that I can survive all of this.
think I'm done. Like I cut down one more recipe that I was supposed to do today because I failed it because I didn't have the right ingredient and now I'm not in the mood to go. I just cannot, I don't have the energy to go and get the ingredient and make it. So I decided to skip it. It's fine. I already have a lot of recipes and a lot of content. I cannot believe it. I actually did it. I actually went six days till the morning until night. I can't believe it. Like, I have, wow. I did it. Well, I will know if I finally did it or not once I edit edit the, the recipes and the edit, edit all the videos and I like, create the course, but that's, that's, that's not for me today. That is not what I'm gonna think about. I'm just gonna think about this small victory. Woo! It's hot, also it's hot. So I'm gonna change, I'm gonna start Packing all of this up. My God. Yeah, I'm gonna start packing all of this up. And then, I don't know where my life goes from now on. Like, it just feels like, is it the end? Is this it? It's the final day, as in like the next day of the final day of shooting. So today is that is my last morning at the Airbnb. I already had my breakfast, I returned all the camera and tripod and everything. It was so heavy and my god, I'm gonna feed it tomorrow. I have everything stacked up. I'm just going to enjoy my last hour in this Airbnb by lounging on this on this couch, which I couldn't do much this week. And I'm gonna watch trash TV. That's it, that was the end of this, this crazy one week. Thank you for being there with me. I kind of like made this vlog as sort of imagining you there like as a friend who I'm like lamenting to or complaining to like oh my god this is so difficult I want to puke you know that that kind of a feeling so that's that's what I was thinking when I was vlogging so yeah you were in my imagination you were here supporting me and like cheering me cheering me on anyway cheesy corny I know but this is this is that's what I feel like right now so I'm going to continue watching and I will see you later for the next one. Bye.